Hello everyone, welcome back to Tector.com. In this lecture, we will start with increasing and decreasing nature of function. So let's get started. The first one here is we have a function which is so as name suggests increasing and decreasing function it means the in increasing function is one whose value is increasing and the decreasing function is the one whose value is decreasing with respect to increase in x okay so let's start with increasing first so here i can see that with the increase in x the value of y is increasing but sometimes it's also not increasing in this range if you see the value of y is not increasing okay so we have two conditions in case of increasing also so for x and x1 and x2 x1 and x2 belongs to the domain of the function if x1 is less than x2 that is x2 is greater than x1 it implies that fx1 should also be less than fx2 okay so it means that we have for increasing value of x or for greater value of x we have greater value of function okay so if this this greater value is strict okay this always holds then it is strictly increasing strictly increasing strictly increasing but for the same situation if we have fx1 which can be either less than or equal to fx2 that is the value may increase or will be equal to okay the value for x2 fx2 will be greater than or will be equal to then it is just increasing not strictly increasing means it is not always increasing that is strictly increasing means it is always increasing and here in just increasing means it is increasing or it will be equal so we have here two examples for this x1 and x2 if you see the value is either in this function it will be either fx1 will be less than or equal to fx2 okay whereas in this function fx1 will be less than fx2 not equal to equal to will not be here it will be always strictly less so this is strictly increasing function this is strictly increasing and this is in just increasing not strictly increasing okay fine now similarly we have decreasing so for decreasing case also if we have something like this like the value of function is decreasing like this and we can have other example like the value of x is decreasing okay so in this case if you take 2x you may get same value but here if you take 2x you will be have having always decreased value of fx so x1 x2 here it will be it will be for x1 less than x2 you will have fx1 either greater than or equal to fx2 okay while here you will have x1 less than x2 implies you will get fx1 always greater than fx2 okay means value is always decreasing here but here the value is value may decrease or will be equal okay so this is this is decreasing and this is strictly decreasing right now we will solve the problems over it so how do we solve the problem using derivative we can solve this and we can check how to whether the function is strictly increasing 
or increasing or decreasing in anything. So what is the method of solving? We first go and find out for a function fx fx we find out the derivative f dash x okay we find out derivative and if this f dash x okay is greater than or equal to zero okay then we will say it is increasing fine if f dash x greater than zero always then we will say it is strictly increasing okay now similarly for decreasing if f dash x is always less than or equal to zero we will say it is decreasing okay but f dash x is if less than zero always less than zero then we will say it is strictly decreasing fine so these are the conditions we also have one corollary that is let's understand it with an example first let's take fx equal to x cube so what is the curve here the curve will be something like this right something like this so at if you see function has derivative f dash x is equal to 0 at x equal to 0 right f dash x is greater than or equal to 0 right here so it means we will say that the function is increasing not strictly increasing but if you see the function it, the value of function is always increasing with the value with the increase of x so here one Im important conclusion is there that f dash x is always greater than zero okay for entire domain of this function except few points okay except few points where the f dash x is equal to zero I mean finite number of points on finite number of points f dash x poses a value of zero otherwise it is always greater than zero okay then in this case also we will say that the function will be strictly increasing okay similarly for decreasing if f dash x is always less than zero except few finite finite points in the domain then we will say that it is strictly decreasing okay for example if you see for this this function okay this is a function where at this x equal to 0 you will say that this is uh, or let's take let's take another function that is minus x q okay so how do we draw minus x q it will be something like this something like this Okay. so this is if you see is strictly decreasing but at x equal to 0 it will have f dash x equal to 0 fine so likewise let's solve the problem to clarify the concept more so let's get involved in solving problems thanks for watching